This video is part of my 1 to 99 skill guide. If you want to learn the best way of achieving max level, click the first link in the description to go to the main guide. Hello everyone, Chaos here and welcome to another old school RuneScape video. Today, cooking training methods. In this guide, I will show you three things. How to do the one tick Karambwan cooking method, how to train with wines, and finally the best cooking spots in the game. When cooking Karambwans, you will typically make some money, but it depends on how many you cook successfully. As mentioned before, training with wines will cost you less than around 6 million GP for 99, and finally, I'll mention the cooking spots from best to least effective. Since I haven't mentioned what a tick is during my guides, let me quickly explain it. Simply put, a tick is the unit of time that governs RuneScape. Every action that happens in the game will happen at a rate of one tick, which is 0.6 seconds. This is the equivalent to nearly 100 beats per minute, and if you use RuneLight, you can actually use the metronome plugin to know when to perform your clicks. To one tick around one, grab all your raw food and zoom in on the game in such way that the bottom left corner on your inventory is near a cooking range. From here, use the bottom left karam one on the range every tick while pressing and holding 2 on your keyboard to cook them immediately. If done correctly, you can see experience per hour of up to 800 or even 900k. According to the wiki, if you do this tick perfectly, it will yield around 950k experience per hour, but this is actually highly unlikely. Next, let's quickly look at how to do wines. This is just like stringing bows when fletching. Simply grab 14 grapes and 14 jugs of water from the bank and use one on the other to create unfermented jugs of wine. After a few seconds on your inventory or in the bank, they will ferment, granting a ton of experience. The cool part about this is that if you keep doing this, the wine won't ferment until a certain time has passed since you added the last grapes to a jug of water, which will cause you to get a massive amount of drops in experience when you're done. Finally, here are some of the best spots to cook in the game. First, we have the Myths Guild, which has a cooking range right next to a bank. Next, the Hosidius Kitchen is great since you will burn food less often. You can also go to the Rogue's Den for a bank right next to a fire, but you may burn a little bit of food since it's a fire and not a range. The Cooking Guild also offers a very quick way of training, and the requirement to enter here is really not that high, at just a measly 32 cooking. And finally, it's also nice to train at the Grand Exchange since a lot of people train fire making here, which gives a quick access to a bank. And that's pretty much it. More information at your disposal for one of the quickest 99s in the game. I will see you in another video if you decide to keep watching. Best of luck and have a great day.